Okay guys, so I made a video a while back about how to uh, edit in DaVinci Resolve and in this I showed you how to export the footage. Now I told you that if you wanted to export in 1080 you can select that and if you want to export in 2.7k select that option. Uh, now Paul are you to Linde? I hope I pronounced that right. Sorry if I haven't, Paul. It's pointed out there is actually no option for 2.7K. So what I've done is I've made this video to show you how to do that, if that's what you want to do. Let's get started. So uh, the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go over to Deliver. And uh, now if you just uh, browse where you want to place your uh, video, I want to put it in this folder here and I'm going to call this one Waterfall. Uh, next, we are going to scroll down. I'm going to export this as an MP4. And then when we go to resolution, there is no 2.7K. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to Custom. And in Custom, you can write down what size you want. Now, I found that when you go to Custom, it doesn't actually always give you the option just to change it how you like. So if you press Custom, and this doesn't happen, this doesn't appear. We can just go into File, Project Settings, and make sure we've got the right resolution set. Now to export at uh, 2.7K, we need this to be 2704 by 1520 pixels. And press Save. So once we know we've got the uh, project settings to the right resolution, and we go to Custom, it should automatically put these settings in. If it's got the wrong settings in there, but this box is still available, we can then just change it to 2704 by 1520. So you just want to check everything else is right. And actually where I've adjusted the settings, um, it, it's taken my path away. So I'm going to drop it back into the folder I want it to go into. And again, rename it Waterfall. And then I'm going to go add to render queue and start render. So this is going to start our render. Now this is actually a really short piece of footage, uh, but where it's such a big file at 2.7k, it's going to take slightly longer to render if you're used to rendering in 1080. So I'm going to fast forward through this bit. And uh, once we're done, we can then go into the folder we saved it into and double click on the footage. And there we go. This is my uh, amazing waterfall footage. Lovely. Okay, and uh, just to prove it, I'm going to go into uh, Properties and go into Details. If we look at the resolution, we can see it's uh, 2.7K here. Okay, guys, sorry for missing this out in the last video. I hope you found this useful and I hope to see you in the next one.